Oh, hi, I didn't see you there. I was just um, playing on my Nintendo Switch because the new Sephiroth DLC has finally come out, and oh boy, it sure is a blast. I hope nothing but that happens to. What the hell? What the fuck? Oh, come on, Nintendo. You've already taken down enough tournaments already, and now you've taken my Switch as well. You know what, Nintendo? Fuck you! Now, I obviously still love Nintendo a hell of a lot, but, like, come the fuck on! This is the company who have characters such as Mario, Link, Kirby, and the list goes on and on, full of gaming history. And all they do is want to play video games, enjoy the characters, and enjoy the story, and enjoy the music. Like, who cannot enjoy Delfino Plaza? Oh yeah, I forgot, you don't like releasing your own music too! Honestly, it baffles me these days on how... Corporate companies just make the stupidest decisions ever, and it's just so hard to understand. Those Nintendo ones are just a few examples, and sometimes decisions are just mistakes. Like, well, Cyberpunk 2077. Like, seriously, this game was not ready to release whatsoever. It might as well should have been delayed again. But those are just more of delayed games and stuff. They're not really the worst decisions, and if anything, they're kind of needed. Honestly, though, probably one of the most worst decisions was probably, well, FIFA on Nintendo Switch. This game absolutely got bamboozled on the Switch. Look at that user score. It's absolute shit. This is just the laziest way for EA to release a game. Let's just give FIFA 17 over and over and over again to the fucking gambling children. I seriously do pray for this company's existence. I don't know how they haven't gone out of business yet. Hello? Hi Activision, it's Blizzard. Did you know that we lost a billion this year? We're now on six billion. Get your shit together. Oh. Oh, alright. Uh, well, that's easy. I can just do this. And there goes 800 employees. That's gonna get us his money back. Don't worry, Blizzard. I don't know why they fired 800 of their employees. It's not like it's gonna get their money back or anything, but... Fucking hell. Anyways, these are just some of the absolute fucking mistakes and terrible decisions ever that these corporate assholes of companies just absolutely make. They are honestly stupid. Other than delaying games, they're all stupid. They're just honestly fucking stupid. Either way, I'm done with this video and I'm gonna need to check how much birthday money I have left because, you know, I'd be saving up for some shit. So I'll go.